Hello and welcome back to Motorsport Informers. I'm Teddy and today we've got a behind the scenes vlog for you. So today I've had Clive's car in. Some of you will know Clive very well, he's very active on the forums. Um, basically he's had this APR splitter on for quite some time now. Uh, he installed it himself, never had an issue, uh, but he's now concerned of uh, these bars here were pulling down on the underside of the bumper. Um, He's got a, a supercar fest thing where these cars go really, really fast. Uh, and the last thing he wants is he's heard the horror stories of some splitters pulling front ends down and stuff. Uh, so that's the last thing we want. So basically, it's come through this refitting, uh, re securing up to the bumper, um, just making sure it doesn't come off uh, and making sure that it's all set up right. So, got it all back together now. I'm going to get it on the car. Uh, and then we've got another couple of things to do on it, I think. Um, but other than that, this front end's done. So, Ben, or as we know him, Eggnog, uh, has just fit uh, our chassis stage zero to his car with the dual rate springs. Um, it's a black bullet. Uh, this is the first one I've ever seen, and I'm in love. It, it, I why no one has bought more of these, I don't know. Or oh, there might be more, but they're not near us, so... What a car. <laughs> what a car. And on that chassis stage zero, that's mega. Yeah, buzzing with that, so I've just give it a quick road test. Uh, and now it's back onto Clive's, so... Yeah, you best go catch up with D, see what D's doing. So, today I've been on Gavin's. Uh, new S550 actually. He's actually got a yellow Camaro that we're going to be supercharging shortly. Um, he's just tried us off to a S550 Mustang as well. So uh, we've just put the external oil cooler kit on this car and the no more yellow kit. So we've got rid of all the yellow lights on the front end. So it's got full white LED lights now, um, as well as the oil cooler kit. So the car's more or less done. Going to get it back on ground and he's going to come pick it back up. Um, and then I think the next time we see him, we'll be supercharging his Camaro, so should be sick. Today we've got Wayne's S550 in, the Orange Fury, fitting a carbon fibre crop shaft. Taking his stock one off there, as you can see. We've also put brand new discs on the front. And um, yeah, he's having the next pipe as well, so let's get on with it. So, the front splitter is now on, it's fully installed. This thing is mega secure now, so I've got that sword. While I were here, I actually noticed that the pads were literally... So, this much left. Um, yeah, they're not in the best condition either, they're starting to crack. Um, but we've got some new pads in. The discs are okay, but we'll go again. Uh, but as aware that one day we are going to have to replace the discs with the uh, new pads. So we're upgrading the pads, keeping the discs, just in it all, name safety, really, because it's going to be doing really fast pulls and stuff. So yeah, we need to get this side done, do the other side, uh, and then Clive's on his way. So and then I get to show you my new toy that we've got. So yeah. So it's actually day two now, uh, I stayed a little bit late last night, I rushed home to get a haircut. Uh, I'm coming early this morning to build up the new tyre I mentioned earlier, uh, and there it is. So I know we don't have a show tools here, but we're all like into tools, so well I am anyway. Uh, so yeah, it's pretty cool, come have a look at this. So yeah, that's my new tool trolley. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's one of the first in the UK. Uh, but I do want to thank Dave with the Black Bullet for helping me build it. It's like he came in and helped me put it together. So massive thank you to you, mate. So now we're going to head over to DAB Auto Care and check out what Bean is up, been up to with Asbo map. We've dug it out, ready for Santa Pod. It's getting some track prep. It's going to look mega. Okay. 
guys, this is a bit of a new style of video we're doing. We want to know what you think. So make sure you get all your thoughts down in comments. Let us know if you like it, you hate it, whatever. Just let us know what you think. Nice one, guys. We'll see you next time.